Democrats in Indiana's General Assembly are giving us an early look at their priorities going into a new session. This comes a day after Governor Eric Holcomb revealed his agenda. News 8's government reporter Garrett Berquist outlines what's on their minds. Democrats remain a super minority in both chambers of the General Assembly, but they say some of the ideas the governor put forward are issues they've been pushing for for years. Democrats say they will back the governor's plans to increase public health funding and to eliminate textbook fees. Just like in Congress, the bill that spells out the budget has to go through the House first. House Minority Leader Phil Giaquinta says Democrats and Republicans have discussed spending priorities informally for months. He also says Democrats will focus on quality of life issues, such as universal pre-K. When uh, kids uh, get into pre-K and uh, start learning early, that they uh, become better students, they go on to graduate high school and on to college. Um, and so I think anything that we can do that invests um, uh, in, in the state with regards to the education, uh, I think will um, uh, will uh, make Indiana one of those states that's going, again, going to want attract folks to live here. Coming up at six, we'll hear from Gia Quinta and from Senate Minority Leader Greg Taylor about their health care priorities this session. At the State House, Garrett Bergquist, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.